if you look back to the second round of the playoffs when Tampa Bay played the Florida Panthers, the Panthers were priced around minus 170 as well. So if you think back to a couple of months ago, we probably would have agreed that the Panthers and Avalanche were uh, comparable threats to the Lightning's uh, chances of, of three-peating as Stanley Cup champions. And uh, it doesn't look like the betting market has... Uh, has done an about face even after the, uh, the Lightning swept the Panthers in the second round. But I think there are some similarities uh, to that series and the Stanley Cup final. The the Florida Panthers actually, I, I thought, outplayed the Lightning at times in that series, despite getting swept in four straight games. Um, but it all came down to goaltending. Andre Vasilevsky was amazing, stopping 151 out of the 154 shots that he faced and it's not that Sergei Bobrovsky was necessarily bad but he just wasn't able to outplay Vasilevsky and I think the Colorado Avalanche uh, could have a similar concern. Darcy Kemper and Pavel Francouz have been able to get the job done up to this point but neither goaltender is in Vasilevsky's le league and if uh, the there is a big concern heading into this series for the Avalanche it's uh, in the goaltending department for sure but if we remember Back to the start of the St. Louis Blues and Colorado Avalanche in the second round. The Avs had a long layoff after sweeping the Nashville Predators. And although they only narrowly won that game in overtime by a score of 3-2, to two, uh, they generated over 100 shot attempts in that game. So I don't think rust was a factor, and uh, I'm not sure it'll be a factor in Game 1 of the Stanley Cup Final either. Visit VEASAN.com to get current odds. Listen for free, find showtimes, and to download VEASAN Sports Betting Podcasts.